What's up, you guys? All right, y'all. <laughs> I want to share with you guys what's going on. As you all know, I am house-sitting. You might not know, but I'm house-sitting, right? Some kittens. Four cats, to be exact. And um, I found out something a couple nights ago about one of them. <laughs> and um, it's almost kind of comical, but I want to share, show a little bit of the footage of the kitties. This is actually today. Let me see if it'll let me play it. I think it will. Okay, so I had gone out for my run and um, stair climb and I decided to have breakfast at a place that I like. And so I came home and of course they all greet and they loved loves. Now this is this right here is the one, the one with the little white spot. That's Cookie. We're going to be talking about Cookie today. This is Mama, my sweetheart. And like when one of them sees one of them getting loves and rubs and hugs, they come up and sometimes they'll even like cry like give me some attention. So there's all the boys and girls outside. Okay. They out hanging out. You know. They're pretty much outside during the day and in the house at night. So they like the loves. They just lay down and say, give me some more loves. And then she do this. And a lot of cats like this, apparently. But, <laughs> this is not the crux of the story. I just thought y'all might want to see the kitty cats. Okay, so that's that. Let me show you. And then, of course, they play. You know. Yeah, I remember days, I don't know if you can hear the audio, but days we used to just be outside playing. Rolling in the grass. You know, we ain't have a care in the world. Just laying in the grass. I ain't worried about chiggas. Nothing. Right. Okay. So then, not too long ago, I fed them their second meal for the day. And so they eat a lot because they're only like four months old. So, you know, they, they like to eat all the time. They're like guided by food. Um, and... I walked into the kitchen because I normally try to keep them outside, but they've been begging to be in the house for the last few days, so I let them in. And so I'm going to go down and show you. This is the kitchen area. And two of them are in the house sleep, and that's Poochai laid out right there. Poochai sleep. This right here, that's Cookie. Y'all see how Cookie's sleeping? I'm going to tell y'all why Cookie's sleeping like that. All right. Cookie is sleeping like that because I have found out that Cookie be sneaking out at night. <laughs> Cookie be sneaking out at night. And how do I know for certain? She's at least done it possibly three times. Um, two nights ago, I was in bed. It's 11 30, 12 o'clock a.m. at night. So 11 30 p.m. 12 o'clock a.m. and I'm hearing a cat clawing and scratching and you know all of this stuff I'm I'm hearing this um, and I turn off the movie um, I actually was asleep but I had the movie on so I turn it off and I hear this crying and I'm like what is that and so I open the door um, no, I didn't even open the door. I was just sitting there for a bit, just, you know, listening. And I was like, why do I hear a cat, like, crying and meowing? And I'm listening, I'm looking outside, I don't see anything because it's dark. I even flicked the light on, didn't see anything. And then I got back in the bed, and I was like, why is that? And I don't want to open the kitchen door because then they get, they wake up and and they get all excitable and all kinds of stuff and so i was like let me let them sleep i said maybe it's the you know neighborhood cats because there's a lot of them out here and you know they wander around so i sat and i chilled i got back in the bed and i could hear this scratching and i was like what is that so i turned on the light 
and I look out and I can see a body sitting on the table and meow meow turning around and I was like how are you outside <laughs> right because I know you's inside because I fed all y'all why did I bring her so I brought her excuse that photo but <laughs> that's a picture of my one of my good friends who lives on the east coast <laughs> So I let her in to come to find out that she has found a way out of the house. She sneaks through a space in the wall, climbs to the roof, and be out all night. Why did she do it again early this morning? I actually heard her this morning, but I didn't know she got out. I just heard rumbling, and I was like, what they knocking over now? But when I let the other cats out to have breakfast, she was already outside. So that's why this particular video is especially hilarious because she is knocked out because she was sneaking out at night. <laughs> what would y'all do? Y'all, this is, this is a house sit and she has figured out, y'all, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say. Lord have mercy. <laughs> the joys of house sitting. The joys of pets. They're so intelligent. Ooh, she gonna get in trouble. Hopefully she get get her fixed quick. That's all I gotta say. That's all I'm saying, y'all. Travel experiences in the cat world. Anyway, if y'all have questions about house sitting, um, and I'm doing this in Thailand, anything like that, please let me know. I'd be more than happy to assist you along your journey. All right, y'all. Toodles.